The home tie against Sheffield Wednesday saw the return of Gary McAllister after 10 months out through injury. After a poor first half, Coventry turned up the heat in the second period and were rewarded in the 74th minute. Well, Cressman fumbles, Dublin hit the post from well inside the six yard box. Nielsen from further out, well off the mark and Dion Dublin wonders how he didn't score. Well, so do I. When we were talking about great chances, Paul Merson must miss one at Upton Park yesterday. But this is incredible. You think all he's got to do is just make contact with the ball. I don't know where it just catches on the, on the toe, the end of his boot. Didn't quite get his foot round it. But even from that range, he just puts it on target, scuffs it, bobbles it on target, and is sided in the lead. Wheeler. Roland Nielsen supporting infield. Back for Whelan. This is a chance for Coventry. What a save. What a save, son. Edward. Rateng. Whelan. Whelan for Nielsen. Back for Whelan again. Three in the middle for Coventry. Dublin! Huge relief at Highfield Road. Coventry City have taken the lead and when it came, it was a sweet goal for Dion Dublin. Lovely football, lovely goal. Whelan and Nielsen in this right-hand side did ever so well together. Just look at Whelan's determination. Gets in front of Humphreys again and that's a great finish. That's an instinctive finish. He didn't have any time to think about this Dion Dublin. It arrives quickly and that's a beautiful finish. Hit the target and he's making life difficult. That's exactly what he did. Sweet goal. It's been on the cards. Exactly they've deserved what it. They wanted. <laughs> they've kept it going. They've stuck at it and they've got the reward, Coventry.